And welcome back to the Green Family Farm here in our Green Family Legacy, where Great Aunt Allison has broken out the credit card again and managed to transform the yard. I am so excited, and it is actually really hard to see because it's freaking very dark right now. <laughs> and that's actually what inspired me to go ahead and have a uh, Allison who totally has exhausted herself and is now taking a little nap uh, from all of her excited activities in the yard. But that is why Emma, uh, Allison decided that she really, really loves her roses. She can grow some magnificent, glorious roses and wants more ways to show those off. So we have redone the rose garden side of the yard and I am so in love with it. We have actually taken a whole bunch of little plants and kind of mix them in with the roses. We're starting to dismantle the strict rows that we usually do. I want to start doing more gardening where we integrate the different types of plants since in real life doing polycropping or doing um Oh, what are the other phrases that people use? Monocropping is where you have just one plant and you keep just that plant. One field of potatoes, one field of lettuce. But if you kind of intercrop is another word that people use. Intercrop or inter uh, polycropping are two different ways that you can actually have companion plants. You can mix different plants together to try to help them have different benefits. Uh, oh God. Gosh, little Belle is coming to visit. Hi, Belle. This is our cousin Belle. Wow. And she just like ran right up and just wants to chat with us. That is so cool. Let's hang out with little Belle for a minute. Um, gosh. And if, like I was having, okay, let's see. Maybe we can ask about school because we just had our last day of school, which I think makes Fern so freaking happy. Uh, let's be thankful that like, I'm done with school. It was my last day. And actually Belle should be growing up pretty soon. So Belle should actually be growing up into a teenager when Amber does. She is way past time for that, but I'll explain more about Belle's story another day. Anyway, long story short, what I was trying to say before I forget is that we're going to start doing more intercropping where you mix different plant types together. So right now we have all of a rose garden, but I want to put in a few other types of flowers. There's a lot of off season flowers over here, like our daisies. <gasps> the daisies are so cute and it's super dark, but I swear like there's more daisies over here, bluebells, like it might be nice to kind of mix some of those together. Oh, hey, and Tate and Zoe are both over here at the same time and they're hanging out. This is so cool. We're really getting a lot of the family coming to visit. We need to spend more time with our extended family. But we're going to be doing a lot more intercropping because it is something good in real life and it is something that kind of helps to keep all the nutrients in the different soils uh, being exchanged because, for instance, soybeans can return nutrients to the soil. It can, they're nitrogen fixers, so they can actually put nutrients into the soil, whereas growing corn will suck it out of the soil. But if you kind of do different crop rotation is probably something you guys are familiar with. And basically I freaking love aspects of plants and farming. Okay. Uh, so we are no longer going to be having these strict rows. We're going to start having grandma Allison really add a little bit of a true gardener's touch to her yard. And this is just the beginning because we're filthy rich. So we've got plenty of money to be able to play with. Uh, but we made like a little rose garden over here. I'll probably put other flower types in here that seem a Appropriate. like the chrysanthemums seem very appropriate to mix in. Uh, we also have little rose bushes. So we have a big rose bush, like this is actually just like a big bush. And then I put some rose bushes around it just to try to make things seem a little bit fuller. Like maybe we can imagine that is one gigantic rose bush instead of three or four different rose bushes. So I'm really excited about that. And I'm really freaking excited about this. I have not yet uh, had this pond as of like, oh, 
that's another llama scout. I didn't know they also came as more teenagers. Uh, Fern might have spent some time with them. But we have the pond, the water garden. I have not had a chance to play with these yet. So we're gonna be adding to the water garden today for sure. But it is the final test day. We have a beautiful new rose garden. Uh, Fern is trying to work on getting her gardening skill up. We're probably going to practice grafting onto some plants in a little bit. Oh, it's so Daisy much fun Bob to hang out with our cousin. <laughs> like, she never really wants to hang out. So this is awesome. Now we've got Thankful Spirit. Um, obsessive, Hug lovingly? Can we do that with our little cousin? Man, Belle, it's so cool that she actually wants to hang out with us. <gasps> Griffin can now easily climb stairs. That's awesome. It's because he is wiggling his way inside. But yes, so last time we left off with Devin having once again been fired. It looks like she's feeling okay about it because she's wearing some nice dry clothing and she's on her way to go have some tofu dogs. Uh, we did make a whole bunch of ice cream because she needed a little bit of ice cream to kind of work herself through the trauma of getting fired again. However, the good news is that she did become a rising star and we now are going to be writing a book all about the like thievery in the neighborhood that will hopefully help her fame some more and after that i'm hoping that she can actually donate to online charities pretty often and we can build up a reputation for being a uh, philanthropist in the community and she wants to start her own business in the future uh, we might even start a club actually, which would be great, called Better Harvest, uh, which are going to be, it's, well, Better Harvest sounds like a, a gardening club, doesn't it? We're going to come up with a good name and she's going to start a business of people who are going to actually be focused on ethical business. Thank you very much. Uh, oh, bye guys. It was really nice to hang out with you randomly. Uh, now I can at least, oh, we're going inside for a bowl of, bye grandpa. It was really nice to hang out with you too. Oh, well, Tate, are you just reassuring me that you're not going to pass out, Dad? Because that's awesome. Let's actually come over and spend some time with our dad. Let's be thankful. Like, Dad, you look so healthy. Oh, I'm so relieved. I've always, I'm always worried that you're, like, just going to die. Because, uh, let's brag about handiness. Because that is something that Pine would be worried about. It's like, wow, Dad, maybe we should go jogging together. I've been thinking about trying to really work on my fitness lately. You seem really happy. Your, your gardening <laughs> outfit looks fantastic. Boy, I'm so happy to see you. Like, Pine is just Ooh, such a sweetheart. Oh. But all right, so Simple today's watch. goals were actually to try to get... Oh my gosh. All right, well, Fern actually doesn't have school tomorrow, so she actually gets to use a vacation day instead of go to school. She never has to do her homework again because she finished high school with only a solid B. A, like, oh, like very average across the board. So I don't know if she's going to be able to snag any scholarships, but we will see. I'm still working out how I'm going to do my college system. Aspen is playing outside. He's probably going to come in. Did he do his homework? I think I will never command him to do his homework, but if he does it on his own, that's awesome. But because he has dyslexia, he really struggles with the written word. Um, I wonder if I can have him do more school projects. Probably. But we're going to go ahead and let him kind of... You don't have to keep raking leaves, buddy. Are you happy? Okay. And then I do want to have Devin, now that she's really trying to gather herself together and, and come up with a way to run a business that isn't going to be completely corrupt. Uh, I did want to kind of have her do something today. Oh, she's feeling much darn better. I think I'm going to have her write her book right now. Oh, wait, what does she want to do? <gasps> she wants to hug her son. Her son wants to hug her. One or the other is, is apparently happening. I'm going to let it happen. Maybe she's seeing that she really wants to have like a better lifestyle. Uh, she wants to create better businesses so that her family will do well. Better businesses. Um, a green heart. I'm trying to think what to call her club that we're going to have. I was going to have it be better harvest. Um, or maybe, or maybe a family harvest. I, I can't get my head off of plants. There's no hope for me. Run away, all of you, while you still can. I just cannot get my mind off plants. Oh, gosh. And now she wants to go and kiss her husband, who, like, actually has been wanting to spend some quality time with her. 
Holy freaking double dose there, Batman. Fine, Pine. I can take a I can take a hint. I'm gonna send these two upstairs then. And she even wants to go kiss him too. I guess she's feeling much better about this whole ordeal. But I guess we're gonna spend the night kind of uh hmm. <laughs> Uh, let's go ahead and ooh, let's have her clean a little bit so that she feels a little better too. Let's go ahead and throw away. Pine, have you done everything? Why don't you appreciate this just randomly? And then is there anything else to clean? Oh yes, there's a mess right over here. Let's go ahead and mop this up so that we can get everybody feeling like even though they have had to deal with finals even though they have had to deal with so many struggles it's all going to be worth it everybody everybody i hope is going to feel like it's going to be okay see even now devin is tidying things up where are you going with that devin come on there you go let's not put it on the ground please there, so now she's tidying up. Everybody's trying to pile around the trash can. Yeah, now she's happy. Let's have her appreciate this random object. And then... Yeah, we're just gonna get everybody all lined up. But I freaking love the new garden! Oh, I'm so happy about this. We need to see it. Oh, I know, Allison! Allison! You need to hurry and finish. Why does a ghost need to eat? Why does a ghost need to sleep? Fine, we're gonna take care of Allison today too. I really wanted to kind of scooch things along, but I, I'm realizing I'm not sure who to focus on next. The baby is sad. Devin. Devin, we're gonna get you happy. We're gonna get you writing that book. Uh, give me a second, because I, I feel like I'm stuck because I need, I'm like a little Sim who needs reset because I cannot think of what I want her business to be called. One second. Greener ways! I am so proud! Still has to do with leaves, but it, we're gonna call it greener ways because there are greener ways to do business and it's going to be her way of showing that you can do business business ethically. You can also, oh look everybody is like, oh, yes, woo! you know, it's been hard, but we're all going to make it better. Oh, we gotta hug this kid because this is, this is just, ah. Uh, Okay, complain about final test day. Give talking to express. Let's express our love for our little one. Uh, can we do anything? Maybe. We, can we ask him about his face? Because he's feeling really clingy. Maybe it's because his mom just started an official job. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's precious. Oh, that's precious. Bye, Grandpa. Oh my goodness. Greener ways. I want to be near my parents. A gentle nudging to play with other children, make friends, or even gain skills would help me become more independent. Um, well, son, it's actually time to go to bed. So let's actually tuck him in, if we can. Let's put him to bed. I don't think I've ever tried putting a kid to bed before, like this. Oh, Aspen reached social level six. He can now talk to stuffed animals to reduce sadness and research uh, items on the computer. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh! Somebody is like, something's happening and I want to be involved! Oh, come on, Griffin. We're gonna put the boys to bed. Aww. This is so cute. I feel like she's feeling super content because she's like, you know, I'm I'm here today. Oh, jeez. Who needs their cleaning ability done? Because can we clean? Oh, jeez. Kids can't clean these things? That's too bad. Oh, we tucked one kidlet in bed. Time to time to read Griffin to sleep. Because he needs to go to bed too. Oh, jeez. Everything's broken and messy. This eternal house. There we go. Most people had a good day. And that means it's two in the freaking morning. Sleep. Sleep, children. Amber, you may not have school tomorrow. Uh, but your birthday is tomorrow, Amber. Oh, and I'm so excited. I, I figured out, I really was like a little sim with a routing issue because I was like, wait, wait, does not compute, does not compute. I'm supposed to be doing something here, but I don't know what. Um, greener ways, a more ethical way to do business that also results in more green, the cold hard cash kind of greenery treasure. Of course, she's reading a story about how to become wealthy and get treasure to her son. I love Devin. I've never really played with a snob before like this, but uh, it's just fantastic. We could insta-repair. This should not 
be broken? Repair? Pine? Pine? We got pine. Uh, if you could, do please come over and I guess insta repair this place. Well, actually, I like it when he can use the insta upgrade, so let's just have him, because all these are already upgraded. Let's have him repair that. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, Devin, greener ways. That is going to be your club. Let's go ahead and create it now. Green family farm. That's when we're like kind of doing tending. This is just like a family roots um, club. Ooh, let's do this one. Okay, I'm gonna make it now so that I don't forget. And we're gonna call it Greener Ways, uh, Greener Ways, hmm, Greener Ways Corporation. There we go, Greener Ways Corporation. Her very first corporation. I'm actually coming up with ways that I can make different businesses in my Sims worlds as I create more families and they might have some overlap where we can have different Sims run businesses. The businesses uh, become more famous, have different opportunities that they could do. Different Sims could work for different businesses. Thieves could steal from specific businesses and families. It's gonna be fun. I won't bore all of you. Well, it's probably not boring. But I want to, to confuse all of us by talking about those things just yet, though. But all right, Greener Ways Corporation. There are, and actually it wouldn't be a leaf. Let's, where's the money? There we go. That's what she wants to see. There are better ways to do business in a modern world. Green, green, and uh, green, hmm, let's see. Ethical, let's, we want it, we want people to be really uh, inspired by this. Environmentally green. Uh, growing, honestly grow, honest growth of our communities. And uh, the unparalleled greenery, uh, cold heart, the unparalleled greenery of success, which is going to be our subtle way of kind of giving a nod to <laughs> being able to make a ton of money. Uh, all right. And the requirements for being able to get into this are going to be the career business. Ah, Devin, Devin, you're not in business right now. So financial status, wealthy, more than 30,000, I think. Um, that's going to be one of them. And then skill or trait, maybe charisma, I think. Cause this is going to be kind of like charisma. There we go. So you need to be wealthy and charismatic. And then maybe just a teensy pinch of celebrity level, perhaps. Devin, okay, celebrity level is apparently broken right now. So we'll worry about that later. That might have been modded on my end. Well, we'll do business once we actually get her back in business. But that's really exciting. Greater Ways Corporation. Wonderful. We need to get some new members before we can start a gathering. Um, oh, but I think I can actually have her earn... Well, I guess you have to start a gathering during points. <laughs> All right. Well, we have to have somebody in here. We might even just temporarily add Pine in so that we can start getting points for the business <laughs> once she gets it going. But all right, speaking of pine, why darling, uh, let's go ahead, have a little sit. He's got like literally one thing on his mind lately. I guess that's his way of, of kind of like missing having his wife around. Uh, where's Toby? Doing Toby stuff. Oh, I'm so happy. We're gonna, we're gonna make a comeback. After Amber's birthday tomorrow, then we will go ahead. She's totally inspired for this new business. It's awesome, darling. You just would not, you wouldn't believe it. Can, how do you cuddle? Cuddle? Blow kiss? Uh, serenade? Hmm. Snuggle? There we go. You, oh, on the same side of the bed. <laughs> you can tell I'm a Sims 2 player, can't ya? There, aww. See, I knew you guys would get to be feeling better sooner than later, especially now that she's really, Devin's really feeling this. I think Pine's going to go jogging in the morning because he's going to just want to kind of, you know, his wife is coming, or his, his, 
If we're going to go by the name Greener Business, my dear, then it's going to be time to pull the Green family name. Hmm? Hmm? I do think that it may be time to tie the knot with these two, but we don't want to, we don't want to overwhelm the week. I think, uh, maybe Saturday? Saturday might be a good day. I don't know if it's going to be as big of a wedding as we once upon a time planned, but I think it's time. Saturday. Saturday will be the day that we get them married. Finally! Oh, the big rich wedding that Devin always wanted can actually happen with all of the freaking money that we have too. <laughs> all right, where are we here? Um, Serenade, oh, Snuggle, which is just so cute. Uh, tickle mercilessly. She is feeling kind of playful and inspired and I think she has a hidden inspired, uh, a little hidden inspired. <laughs> she does. Make a move. I haven't seen them do this in days. Like donkey days. Oh, she's so cute. Pine would definitely express his fondness. Look deeply into her eyes. Oh, are you going to bed? You goose bucket. And then there we go. Alright, you two, off you go. Yep, alright. I shall leave you be. So, they're quite happy and off to spend a little bit of time together. H half the kids have school. Well, one of the four. 25% oh, of the kids have school tomorrow. <laughs> and the other half are either done with school forever or getting ready for their birthday, in which they will start prepping for some special tests uh, for a new stage of school. The family ghost is quite happy, and we've got a new garden! I am so content! Oh, can I at least see the sunrise? Let's see if we can just... I don't even care what all of you are going to be doing. I want to see the sunrise over my beautiful new garden. I'm honestly tempted to swap out the, the fancy tree for like another one of these cherry blossom trees. Everybody's actually asleep. <gasps> Give me a moment. I need to appreciate this time in the garden that we have actually brought from from ruin into success from seed to success as Devin's book says time to just kind of bask all oh, the roses are blooming oh, give me some sun oh my gosh the rose bush that we have onions on has just given us onions and roses oh am I gonna get some sun ah! look at that Oh my gosh, slowly but surely, the sunlight, very slowly, is coming into the yard a little bit more maybe, so that I can appreciate the final moments of this beautiful new area. I think it's a cloudy day. <laughs> But all right, guys, so nope, Fern, Amber, you two are excused from school to the day. Uh, so I actually need to call in vacation day for them. We have our beautiful new garden. It is already ready to harvest. Uh, we've got a little bit of work to do. Fern actually gets to celebrate the fact that she no longer needs to go to school. It's her very first day of freedom uh, in this little in-between time before college. I think she might kind of work on her freelance botanist skills. I think that she really just wants to go and spend donkey days with Toby. And we'll have to see what she gets up to. Uh, and Amber, it's your birthday next time! I am so excited! This is going to be delightful. We are going to be spending the day with Amber tomorrow because she is going to try to snag as many of those scout badges as she can before she's going to be far too old for scouts and far too busy with her new private school that we'll be talking about. But all right, thank you guys so much for joining me. I know this was kind of just like chasing them around the night as we often do, but I'm really happy with where their stories are going. And I cannot wait to share more with you guys next time. So if you would like, do please leave a like to uh, perhaps pluck a rose from our beautiful new rose garden. And if you would like to watch over the family tree, do please consider subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.